week we're highlighting important financial topics to help you out. Anchor Todd Quinones is here with our Good With Money segment. Hi, Todd. Marissa, how are you? As we know, of course, the housing crisis has long been over, thankfully, right? But there are still plenty of people who are struggling to pay their mortgage. And joining me now is Nicole Cypress with America First Credit Union. Nicole, thank you so much for being here. Yes, thank you. Uh, it takes a long time to rebound for people who got caught up in that, and many people still are. Yes, it does. It takes uh, quite a while, but the good thing is, is that, you know, if you were affected by that, if you did suffer from a foreclosure, um, you know, that usually takes about seven years right. um, that it will affect your um, credit rating and your credit score. Um, but there is hope. Right. So there is a, there is sort of a way out of there. It takes a long time, yes. but there are certain steps that you could do. And if you do it consistently, you can sort of rebuild, rebuild your credit, mm -hmm. which is so important. Yes. Yes, yeah, so I think that the biggest thing, if you are in this situation, is um, get with a financial counselor um, and take those steps to put a budget together, to stick to that budget. It's hard sometimes, you know, things come up, but if you're planning, saving, and you're sticking to a budget, slowly you'll be able to pay down that debt and then be able to recover and, and see that credit score begin to rise. Yeah, we see so many mistakes still being made to this day, and a lot of them, obviously, people, once they sort of fall behind, uh, they, you know, their reaction sometimes is just to put their head in the sand and just say, I can't deal with it, right? But that's, yeah. as hard as it is, they have to address it, right? Oh, yeah, and yeah. you need to be proactive. If, you're, if you find yourself in a situation where um, you are, like, falling behind on those mortgage payments and you have defaulted, um, again, you need to get with a financial counselor. You may need to, like, get with an attorney, depending on the situation and how far you have defaulted. Um, if they've, you know, filed a, a notice of default, um, your lender, you do need to, don't bury your head. It's just gonna get worse if you bury your head. You need yeah. to be involved. You need to take those steps to, again, be proactive and, and start climbing and working your way out. Well, I'm curious, what do you think we have all learned, both of us, those who are buying mortgages and those who are, are lending, what, through all of this? What do you think, what's your takeaway from that? Um, I think the biggest thing we learned is that, you know, subprime mortgages, right. Probably not the best idea. Yes, yet. right. Um, and I think uh, a lot of consumers learned that um, don't go really into debt. Like, be careful about what you're signing for. Right. Um, if you're not able to make those monthly payments or it's a stretch for you to make those monthly payments, maybe that's not the best thing for you to do at the time. Um, and maybe start saving if you have a goal to own your own home. Um, start saving. Put a nest egg away so that you can put a down payment on. You can lower those payments by having a substantial down payment before you, you know, sign and, and get a mortgage. Loan. And we also saw real quick uh, people getting in trouble with the adjustable rates, and, oh, and yes. that's something you, I mean, that's depending on, you know, what you have in the bank. You got to be careful there. You do that. need yeah. to be careful because depending on what's happening with the economy, yeah. that can affect your payment. And so, yeah, be very careful about that and be educated. I think the biggest thing is educate yourself. Um, and what the options are for you before you jump into something you're not quite yeah, sure about. Try and avoid that trouble. Good advice. Nicole Cypress from America First Credit Union, thank you so much for your time. Thank I appreciate you. it. All right, Marissa, back to you. Todd, thank you. Our Good With Money segment is sponsored by our 13 Connects partners, Subaru of Las Vegas and America First Credit Union. And again, you can check out ktnv.com slash goodwithmoney for many other financial topics that could help you. We'll be right back after the break.